I thought I would go live. No, I'm not wearing a scarf. It is beautiful weather out here in California. This is not the fall fashion. This is my CVS receipt. I didn't know what else to do with it. I'm, I'm at a loss for words. I don't know uh, how to hold It's like a boa constrictor at this point. And for those of you who don't know, because I have a lot of international fans, uh, CVS is a pharmacy here in California, actually it's all over the United States of America. So if you have a CVS where you live, uh, you will know that CVS will often print out like coupons or little deals on the receipt. So I was, uh, I was just minding my own business. I bought like two items and I put in my credit card and it was very embarrassing because it just kept kicking out receipt after receipt and coupon after coupon. I'm like, what the hell is going on? And it made me look self-conscious. So I just started, I just wrapped it around my neck and walked out. Now, you can see what I actually purchased is on the top here. Okay, let me see. I don't know where this thing begins. Let's first lay it out here on the sidewalk. All right. So uh, I'm going to read some of the different things. Okay, here's what I actually purchased right here. I purchased some bounty sheets, some moisturizer, bounty sheets, moisturizer, and uh, some tape. It's like a, a waterproof tape. So when I do athletics, you know, I'm going to the gym. Sometimes I get a blister on my foot or something. I tape up my foot and I keep running, okay? So that's the actual receipt right there. And then, then it started just printing, right? Here we go. Uh, it says uh, $2 off Colgate toothpaste, $3 off Cetaphil facial cleanser or moisturizer. Okay, I could get down with that. Maybe they felt like I needed to wash my face, which I do need to shave. Uh, then it's $2 off toothpaste or any other Colgate product. So if anyone needs that one, I got it right here, $2 off. Then it was buy three Reese's or Kit Kats, get one free. That might be trying to get rid of the Halloween candy. Buy three, get one free. Then it says 30% off children's pain reliever. Uh, why would a dude be buying candy and then children's pain relievers? Those two do not mix. That sounds like a creepy guy getting ready for something. All right. 40% off Maybelline Cosmetics. Oh, man. Maybe I was born with it. Maybe I need $2.50 off a of deodorant. You tell me. I mean, I lasered, I lasered my armpit so I didn't need to use as much deodorant. But, you know, $6 off $30 purchase. If anyone needs that one, that's a good one. $6 off your next $30 purchase. I bought everything I needed today, so I don't need $6 off $30 purchase. $3 off another Colgate toothbrush. What the hell? 40% off tampons, pads, and liners. Why did I qualify for that? $2 off Pantene or Herbal Essence Renew Hair Care. I mean, I got a lot of hair. I could clean it every once in a while. That would be a good idea. $4 off Flu Relief. I'm not even sick, but I guess I can keep it. And they all expire in 10 days. So I got to get sick. I got to wash my hair, do my deodorant, get a tampon. I got to do this this week. Time is running out. $1 off any deodorant of your choice. Okay. $1 off any deodorant of your choice. And uh, that's if you didn't like the other one that they gave you the $3 off. $3 off any cleanse, facial cleanser of your choice. $3 off baby diapers, baby wipes, and more. I don't have a baby it makes me wish I did, because with a deal that good, $3 off, mijo, you could get the diaper for the baby, no problem. Uh, $3 off Neutrogena makeup. I don't know how Maybelline feels about that. And then this last one is what it said. See, he's looking at my receipt. This last one says, $3 off Maybelline because we miss you. It says because we miss you right there. You can't read that, but um, that's what it says. So if you want to see exactly what my receipt looked like, I will lay it out for you just to give you an idea. It starts there and it goes all the way to there. And that's what you get when you go to CVS. Uh, they kill a lot of trees, but they take care of their customers. Thanks for watching live. I'm going to answer your questions right now. Then I got to get going to the gym. All right. Someone said, Kayvon, get the conditioner. You need it. Uh, Kayvon, go find a girl. Give her a tampon. Give her a coupon to make a baby and tell her you got diapers. <laughs> I like that comment. Uh, someone else said, hello. And for those of you who are just now tuning in, uh, this is my CVS receipt. People are going to fight me on the streets. Everyone's gathering around my receipts trying to 
steal them, but I'm going to fight them because these are <laughs> – you already got on a bigger one than that? Yeah, it is. It's the, it, it is the <laughs> – I know, a kite. Yeah, everyone has ideas. I could fly a kite with my receipt. I can uh, write the Declaration of Independence on the back. Whatever you want, we can <laughs> – Take it to the bathroom, use it as toilet paper in case you run out. So, uh, yeah, it's about 12 feet long, and uh, that's my receipt from CVS, everybody. Now, for those of you who want to see me live, you can come to Vancouver, Canada. You can come to Irvine. You can come to Las Vegas, and that's the end of 2018. And my new book is almost out. It is coming out in three weeks. It's like putting a snake back in a basket, by the way. Anyone who did the pre-sale, thank you. We have sold 100 and 20 books and the book is not even out yet the average book sells three to five hundred the first year we have done already for the pre-sale 120 books now i'm trying to sell 2019 books by the end of 2019 i need your help go on gofundme.com slash go persian gofundme.com slash g-o-p-e-r-s-i-a-n just put any donation in order the book i'm gonna send it to you in a couple weeks that's all you need to know. I'll see everyone else in Vancouver, Irvine, Las Vegas, or a city near you. Bye-bye, everybody.